hey guys welcome back to my channel today we'll be making these delicious oat biscuits so guys stay tuned let's get right into the video and meanwhile this is how it is looking golden delicious flavorful and it is very healthy you can snack on this at any time you can also make this for your kids so here are the ingredients i'll be putting the ingredients in the description box below so i'm adding the oats now and i'm adding some milk i'm using everything at room temperature i will give this a mix combine it together very well just like so then cover it once you are done and allow it to sit for at least 15 to 20 minutes before you get back to it then after 15 minutes grating the zest of one orange you can use lemon or you can skip the process but if you want a flavorful oat biscuit add lemon zest or orange zest then add the remaining ingredients i'll be putting the measurement of all the things i'm using here in the description box below feel free to check it out I will also try and leave the measurements inside the video. Add juice from half of an orange or you can add 2 tablespoons of milk at this stage. Combine everything together just like so till so it comes together and stops sticking on the bowl. Then divide into, into two. Spray or uh, sprinkle some flour on your surface. And start kneading this you have to knead this very very flat if you are still watching please give this video a thumbs up then use any shape of your choice to cut this you can use a tumbler a round shape or square shape to cut this out just like so then after cutting this out use your fork to make design on the biscuit and it will also release the air from the biscuit. Then after that, line it up in your baking tray. Meanwhile, before making this, I've already started preheating the oven. Then after lining it up, I'll be putting the big tray under, then the small one on top. And I bake this for about 15 minutes in 200 degrees. Then after that is looking like this it has cooked very well and it came out yummy and crunchy i did not add a lot of sugar in this i added some sugar and some salt but if you don't want it like that you can use only sugar you can use only salt but i just crave for salt biscuits and this came out very crunchy please make sure that after doing this once it has cooled down, store it in an airtight container so that it will not go moist. And that is it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.